Here's one you're going to be talking about for a while. A guy goes in to steal from the gas station. He doesn't use a gun or use armed robbery, but he steals gas from the pump by tricking it so that it doesn't take the card but pumps the gas anyway. Take a good look at this man. Police around the state want him for allegedly stealing gas right from the pump. Watch as he pulls into this Sitco in Plainville. It looks like he's just filling up his car, but in less than five seconds, he has accessed the pump, disconnected the meter, and is filling up his car for free. How much money did you lose on this? I lose almost a hundred gallon. So about $400? $400, 378, so 400 gallon. Now we're not going to show you how he did it, but police say he came right over here and he was able to get access to the side of the machine pried up just enough so he could unplug one of the circuits inside the circuit board. And by doing that, he fooled the machine into giving him gas without paying and he's been doing it across the state. We've been notified by other jurisdictions that they've had this uh, similar complaint, so we are touching base with them. From Bloomfield to Enfield, Windsor to Plainville, and another pump discovered just across the border in Bristol. Police say after the man disables the meter, anyone who fills up on that pump will get gas for free. That is, until it's discovered by the attendant at the station. Investigators believe while there is no danger of fire from the tampering, the man is an expert and has probably been getting away with it for quite a while. The individual that's doing this is the person that we're trying to identify. He has some working knowledge of the pumps, uh, either was in the business or was trained by somebody who was in the business. Police say if you recognize that man, please give them a call. They really want this guy. I'm Bob Wilson on the scene in Plainville, News 8.